And there is the bunny. Yeah, you legit get a freaking bunny laser. An animated bunny laser. Uh, some of the other weaponry. Bro, this gun looks crazy with camos. What the? Look at this, bro. This psychoactive camo. You see how crazy a rabbit can go in this game. <laughs> Y'all gotta drop a like on this video. This is one of the funniest operator skins ever, bro. So, uh, what's up, guys? It's Ray here by Nino or Quaji, and welcome back to another video of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2 Season Freaking 3. In today's video, we're we'll be covering a very special store bundle, the first store bundle of Season 3, the Tracer Pack of Hopping Mad. As you can see, you get two operator skins that are legit rabbits that should have came out for Easter, but didn't, I guess for a couple days late. So 2400 COD points, it comes with two tracer guns, one for the PDSW and the X-12. So if you guys are excited to see what this bundle contains, you know, trying to see the pastel rainbow chocolate eggs effect, tracer effects and everything, see how the operator skins look like in game, and anything secretive about this bundle that you should know and see if it's worth it, Make sure to drop a like in the video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. On this channel, I upload store bundles from time to time, the ones that interest me, like this one or any other tracer pack, you know, animated skins at times, reactives, whatever the case is. And if that sounds good to you or you vibe my personality, then you've come to the right channel. Go ahead and subscribe. I also upload Warzone 2 gameplay from time to time and news and update videos, so we get a nice little variety of content. But that's enough of me plugging myself. Without further ado, let's go ahead and check out what this bundle has. So for our first operator skin, it's actually for claws. We got Mr. Hops. And you gotta hunt down your enemies like Easter eggs with his claws. So, um, yeah. I don't know what else to say. He's a freaking rabbit. It kind of reminds me of the, um, that one Cold War skin. Uh, the Donnie Darko collab or whatever where you had uh, Frank the Rabbit, and now we've got another rabbit skin. So if you wanted to get another rabbit skin, I mean, go for it. I really like the design on this one. It's kind of kind of funny looking. <laughs> Pretty nice. And for our second skin, we had Mr. Hops, and now we got Mr. Hips. And this is also for claws, and it's actually like a, like a yellow bunny instead of like a pink bunny. So very little difference in, you know, the actual skin is just more of a colorful difference, but... Hey, I mean, you get to rock with a fucking bunny freaking tail if you want to freaking destroy. So, yeah, two bunny outfits if you want to, you know, if you're into that. We also got the submachine gun tracer gun for the PDSW. This is the first tracer for the PDSW. And it comes with pastel rainbow chocolate eggs tracers and a chocolate explosion death effect. And with this new update, they actually allow us to see uh, tracer effects, uh, you know, here in the, the main menu, which is pretty cool. As you guys can see, it's... Uh, it's pretty cool. I think it'll look better from my perspective though, but that's a little, nice little preview. You see a lot of good dismemberment uh, from that chocolate explosion. You legit turn your enemies into chocolate. And when it comes to the attachments, these are the attachments that the blueprint comes with. And it's overall just a very clean looking sort of blueprint. I think it'll look pretty decent with some, with some camos, which I'll obviously show off, but uh, it's nothing too crazy, honestly. We also got the X-12 shell cracker, which is for the X-12s. This is the second tracer for the X-12s, I believe. And also comes with a Kimbo by default, which is pretty sweet. And it's the same effect as the PDSW, as you guys can see. Chocolate little death effect, which is dope. When it comes to the attachments of the gun, you know, these are the attachments that it has. It doesn't come with ammunition, so this means you won't be able to put any of the tracers from this gun or the PDSW onto any other guns. It's only for these guns in specific. And, um... Yeah, it's a pretty clean looking gun as well. Nothing special about it. For the weapon charm, we got the Lucky People Foot. We got the Mad Hoppin Weapon Sticker. I wish it was, this was a decal. We also have the Higher Caliber Loading Screen and the Easter Surprise Emblem. And all of this is for 2400 COD points. I don't think it's necessarily crazy, but if you're a PDSW lover, I mean, you might as well cop it for the Tracer Gun. But I don't really see this bundle as anything crazy, but I'm gonna cop it just so I can show you guys if it's worth it or not. And for any of you guys that are curious about, you know, copping this, so yeah gonna put it on show it off in game show off how the operator skins look like in game and everything and yeah let's go ahead and rock and roll so here we have the yolked pdsw and the shell cracker x12 and looking at the yolked you know this is once again the attachments that it comes with and if you guys are curious about how it looks like with camos here's how the base camos look like on the gun huh, I like the pink one on it. it looks really nice here's gold here's platinum here's polyatomic which looks pretty sweet i think and good old Orion. When it comes to the fun camels, here's all the yellow camel looks like on this gun. 
Here's how the uh, the dark purple, dark violet camo looks like on this gun. The solid color camos, you know, a lot of these are going to look pretty clean with the gun regardless. And uh, the special camos, the CDL camos in case you're curious. And the event camos in case you have those as well. But nothing too crazy about the, you know, combining it with the camos or anything, but... Overall, a very nice looking gun. When it comes to the X12 shell cracker here, here's the attachment that it comes with once again. You can't put these traces on any other guns. And here's how it looks like with all these camos, bro. Is it like really bright? Okay, here's gold, here's platinum, here's polyatomic, and here is good old Orion. Orion looks crazy on this gun, bro. It's a lot brighter than uh, some of the other weaponry. Bro, this gun looks crazy with camos. What the fuck? Look at this, bro. This psychoactive camo looks really great on this weapon. You just gotta get the FGX Imperium there, bro. This, <laughs> okay, this, these X12s are kind of just worth it, bro. They they like glow brighter with camos than um, than other weapons. Let me put let me put on a camouflage real quick. Let me see how it looks like in the gunsmith with uh, with the white camo. Is it is that is it that bright in game? Oh, okay. I guess it was just clickbait. <laughs> Yeah, don't don't be fooled, guys. It looks really cool in the menus, but unfortunately, it's not uh, something that you do get. Uh, unfortunately, which I wish it was the case, but you know, it is what it is. It's still a great looking gun overall. Here's the CDL camos, you know, amplified, you know, through the glitch of the the game, I guess you could say, and uh, the event camos, which also look pretty sweet. It just looks sweet in the menus, but not sweet in game. And now we're going to see how the blueprints look like with their meta attachment. So here's the base default yoked uh, PDSW. And now here's the PDSW with its meta attachments. Honestly, not too much of a difference. Besides, you're going to put a camo over this gun anyways, and they'll still look pretty sweet. Here's the Shellcracker X12 with its default attachments. And here's the meta class setup for the X12. Loses a lot of its look, especially because we, you know, took off the barrel. You keep the barrel if you want. So this is the meta class for the X12 in my eyes. But yeah, I believe we covered everything that there is to cover in the menus. And now we're going to go in game, check out how the traces look like on our opponents. And of course, have a good look at our operator skins in game as well. Let's rock and roll. Okay, so here we are with the PDSW, the yoked PDSW. And it looks pretty freaking sweet. Very nice little pink and white sort of vibe. And I like the way it looks. And similarly, here's the Skullcracker X12s, which also look really sweet. And it comes with these blue lasers instead of the usual red laser. <laughs> look at that. It's actually little pink bunnies that are animated. That's actually kind of crazy. Is it the same out here? Yup, you actually get a special pink bunny laser effect. It's actually kind of cool. In fact, if we want to see that a little bit better, let's go ahead and take off the muzzle and put on a uh, an optic so that we can actually see the bunny a little bit better. And there is the bunny. Yeah, you legit get a freaking bunny laser, an animated bunny laser with uh, the PDSW. And of course you get the the, uh, the dual freaking bunny lasers on the X12. And without further ado, let's check out the uh, tracer effect. For you legit freaking shoot eggs. It's a legit a fucking egg, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on. Yeah, they, they, they're legit just freaking eggs on the ground, bro. That's actually insane. And it's legit chocolate on the walls, bro. <laughs> bro why didn't they release this for Easter? Anyways, let's go ahead and check out this uh, death effect real quick. I can't really see it because... He legit has a chocolate arm, bro. I guess I can devour my foes now, literally. Okay, let me see if I if I if I do it in front of. Um... They legit freaking explode in confetti and they turn into chocolate. Legit chocolate limbs everywhere, bro. That is actually pretty freaking crazy. <laughs> now let's check out these pistol powers. Yeah, that is beautiful. That is actually beautiful. So if you want to ever eat your, your opponents and make them turn chocolatey, you got these babies uh, to freaking do that with. It's kind of funny, actually. But yeah, I'm going to switch classes real quick to my meta class setup so that you guys can see my meta class setup still has tracers. If you want to keep the tracers on any freaking gun in the game, 
make sure that you change any attachment that you want except for the ammunition if you change the ammunition attachment you won't have the tracers you see how crazy a rabbit can go in this game <laughs> y'all gotta drop a like on this video this is one of the funniest operator skins ever bro but yeah i think i've showed off everything that i needed to show off i'm gonna go ahead and switch to the other uh operator skin because i have the um the first one on so i'm gonna switch to like the yellow one for this uh third person mode and then we'll call it a video let's rock and roll yeah that's right i'm a freaking bunny bro i'm gonna be freaking bunny hopping and jump shotting and everything it is actually kind of crazy to see this in game bro but yeah uh that's, that's pretty much it to to this freaking bundle i already showed off the other bunny in the uh the first person mode which you could have seen from the uh the finishing move but uh let me know if you guys are gonna be copping this bundle i think the operator skins are hilarious so if you want to be a fucking clown uh by being a rabbit you can do this if you're a fan of the pdsw i'd recommend copping this but otherwise it's not that crazy of a bundle i think it's just crazy in the fact that it's a two fucking rabbits that you can be so uh yeah let me know if you guys cop it or if you guys think it's worth it make sure you guys drop a like on the video subscribe turn on those post notices if you guys enjoyed this video like i said i upload store bundles on this channel pretty frequently we should be getting an anime tracer pack with attack 56 in two days uh we got a bunch of other crazy uh bundles that we're gonna you know obviously highlight on the channel so definitely stick around on the channel and uh stay tuned for more epic videos i really freaking love you guys keep being amazing and keep being big ballers i love you all